hard to get into the final and remain on course for yet another success. Sean Barton alongside me as our expert analyst tonight, the top eight winner with the Kaiser Chiefs against Super Sport United in uh, 2006. Success in this competition, Sean uh, decided inside the opening three months of the season. Uh, the fight by uh, Mopoke and then uh, reacting quite quickly in order to throw his body in front of that shot, left-footed shot, attempted shot on goal. A little action there, not the same. Take the rugby somewhere else uh, next time. Now, it is Mofokeng, and they have the opening goal. No flag, and Kize looks across at the linesman. But Mofokeng picking up where he left off in cup competition at the end of last season. The opening goal inside 15 minutes, and it could be a vital one. And away goal, just what Eric Tinkler did not want to have happen. Well, he did really well. Firstly, he had to time his stay on side, make sure he doesn't get in that offside position. But what a ball here from Sasane. And look at Mofokin timing his run perfectly, just on the shoulder of Mkizi. Obviously, very experienced, but that first touch with the head, obviously, for me, that creates the goal. And Mkizi has got to put his hand up here because you've got to be able to see the player and the ball at all time. And he lost sight of Mofokeng for a slight second. And that second definitely cost them. Well, he looked uh, with some anguish across at the linesman and Kize, but uh, as you put... Game started, you know, fitness over freshness. And you can definitely see Orlando Pai was uh, the upper hand. Now, a mistake from Matsuangangi. Domingo, he has a chance for Chueza. What a save that is. Oh, what a save. Look at him celebrate, and uh, he deserves to as well after that fine stop. That was goal bound from the young Namibian. And again, Mofokeng teasing him, gets the shot in, puts it over the top. He's having a torrid evening, Tommy and Keith. Here's Dion Hotto now on the charge on the left hand side. Coop it over the little touch. Matsangangi with a shot. And then Yama had his head in the right place there. He's feeling it. But he might have rescued City on that occasion. That's a great right footed shot by Mashangwanya. Didn't expect it from him, being a strongly left footed player. But all he had to do is just make contact with the ball. Had Darren Keat and Cupido on the goal line, but still Nyama had to deal with it. Now Jaden Rhodes into the penalty area. Another fine save from Chain. Corner it will be. A good ball up play here from Cape Town City. Good combination play. Jaden Rhodes find himself in that 18 yard area, but Again, Chain does really well, stood st strong, tall. You've got to make yourself big and wait for that shot to come in. And the this was that pass earlier on from uh, Cupido for Chueza. Goes in bravely, the young Namibian. He had a Vista at home in their first league game. Now he has a chance for Jaden Rhodes. He's got the equaliser. Took a bit of a deflection. Caught the goalkeeper and Jaden Rhodes, who might well have had a goal in the first half. Make oh, from Eric Tinkler, that just spurred him on to a different uh, type of tempo in the second half. Again, a long ball, but it's a second ball. Look at the anticipation from Jaden Rhodes. Again, hitting the ball on target. Slight deflection, but you've got to hit it on target to get anything out of it. Great ball from Inyama. No chance for the keeper this time. He has uh, had some uh, heroic saves, but there it comes off in dark. And we are level. There's Rhodes. Has he got a left foot? Yes, he has. That shot is tipped over the top by Chain. Well, that dominance in that short period, obviously, that shot from uh, Jaden Rhodes. Piling a lot of pressure on the uh, Land of Pirates in Kinyar. This pleasure of the fans probably looking for a substitution to happen here. Need something different in the second half. Troll plays that diagonal ball and at the time is run, uh, Dion Hotel. It's a great save from Darren Keat, showing his experience again. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> 
Gilberto looks at his watch, looks at his other watch, and says that's it for the game. So a one-all draw, a stalemate here in Cape Town.